Hey guys, this is South Pole Shooter. Just want to thank you for tuning in. Um, I am going to be cleaning ammunition. I'm going to be turning this, let's see, get that in the view, into this. Quite a difference, huh? Anyways, um, it's super, super cheap, super easy. Um, anybody can do it as long as you have vinegar and uh, some salt and a bottle you can switch around with. So my first ingredient is apple cider vinegar. Um, I was gonna have regular vinegar, but I was being stupid and I completely forgot that I was all out of it. So, oh well, gonna have to go with the healthy stuff. Uh, this is pink Him Himalayan sea salt. Crap, you didn't see that. And then finally, we have a water bottle. Um, so yeah, let me see. So basically, we're going to be cleaning a bunch of these little bullets. They're going to look really pretty. So let me start. So to begin, I'm going to take my water bottle, open it up, and I'm going to place this in there. I'm trying my hardest to pour this. It's kind of an awkward angle. This is about one third a cup of uh, apple cider vinegar. You can use regular vinegar, which is what I was supposed to use, but, you know, see like, okay. And then, about a teaspoonful of uh, Himalayan sea salt. Probably should have put that in first. Not bad. All right, so I'm gonna take that over there. And I'm gonna close this water bottle up. It up a little bit. Just gonna dilute that <laughs> with salt. <laughs> All right. So then you're gonna take some of your ammunition just there. Now you kind of want to make this a little bit quick, just so you uh, prevent the vinegar or any kind of liquid from leaching into your ammo. And this ammo was a uh, Stored in a basement, it wasn't mine, and uh, some rats got into it, so that's nice. And uh, it was kindly given to me by a friend, so that I may make this video and hopefully help out a few people. So, so we've got a few bullets in there. Oh. Oh, all those bubbles coming out. So basically, you just gonna shake that around. I am going to use a, a plastic water bottle because if you use a uh, uh, a glass one, you know you you run the risk of cracking it or you know denting one of your bullets. I mean, not that they're not getting hit together by other bullets, but you know if I could prevent any damage, why wouldn't I? So I'm going to be doing this for a few minutes. If you got time on your hands. You want to watch some TV? You want to teach your kids how to do this or your significant other? All right, it's been about a few minutes. Um, you can already see it kind of looks a little bit shinier. I'm going to really quick drain this, and uh, I will show you what we're dealing with. Thank you. All right, we're back. I'm going to empty this out right now. I would cut this, but I want to do a few more batches. As you can see, quite a difference. You know, still kind of gunky here and there, but I would say that's quite a difference. So I'm gonna do. So I have this uh, this little microfiber towel. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fold it over on itself and just there go. Hey, by the way, um, you might want to put a little something down under here. Uh, this is my mom's table, so if vinegar gets on it, she'll probably kick my ass, but, you know, whatever, for the video, I'll sacrifice it.
by the way, I'm kind of just winging this. Um, I didn't really prepare a, uh, a speech or anything or, or anything like that. Just kind of like going by feel. Look at that. I'd say they are clean. I'll do a separate video of me actually shooting these just to show you guys that it's actually safe. Um, but one thing I would look for are any deformities. Now, uh, uh, the where I got these from, they were kind of just like made out of a home with like rats and stuff. So I mean, that's why I cleaned it. But I doubt rats did any actual damage to them. But yeah, it looks pretty good. Really good, actually. All right, guys. Well, um, thank you for thank you for your time. I appreciate you watching this. Hopefully you watched through, and uh, hopefully I didn't waste too much of your time. Um, if you can like and subscribe, that would be great. Just trying to grow this channel, you know. Hopefully, you know I can be one of the greats or whatever. I don't really care. Yes, I do. Well, see you guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye bye. Hey guys, um, one more thing. I just wanted to show you. I also did some 308 and 22s, um, so you can see this works for multiple calibers. Um, uh, you know, I just wanted to appreciate you guys for, for sticking around and, and watching. So, uh, hope you're doing well and, uh, hope to see you again. Uh, like and subscribe.